A world-renowned Townsville-based artist is lobbying the state and federal governments for the establishment of an innovative arts centre in the city. It's a two-pronged proposal which also includes provisions for artists to be directly involved in the design and construction of public buildings. So far, however, it's gained a lukewarm response. Swedish-born Ture Sjölander is recognised in art circles around the world. He's no stranger in Townsville either for his efforts to get local artists a better deal. When I'm talking about art, I'm talking about uh, communication uh, uh, and uh, also the right to communicate on all levels in all uh, direction into the society. For those who restrict art to oil paintings and sculptures, Mr. Schollander's ideas may seem radical. His latest campaign is to get an arts and technology centre established in Townsville for artists developing new technologies. He describes it as a modern arts media unit to develop video, among other things, as a free art form, utilising the latest computer and electronic technology. Uh, it can be computer uh, uh, assisted the sculptures or computer uh, produced uh, sculptures uh, it can be uh, even made so in two dimensional uh, objects uh, and uh, there is no 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 uh, teaching or no education uh, at all uh, of this kind he expects the center to cost about three million dollars over five years a more immediate and possibly viable proposal surrounds the construction of public buildings. He's begun lobbying the state and federal governments to legislate so a portion of building costs could be dedicated to visual arts within the structure. Public art uh, in the whole entire, uh, entire environment, uh, the whole building, not just one little uh, spot uh, somewhere and then they can justify themselves, we have already done something for the art, that's not enough. Not only does it provide artists rare opportunities, he says it'd take art out of the galleries and into people's everyday lives.